That's it. We've just come down from there. We're just heading uh, back down to the river. Uh, we're, we're still on our way back down to the bottom here. We'll it's a bit of a hike. It's We've come some distance up. We've just gone back down onto the pathway. What leads you down onto the water? You can hear the wait. I don't even know if you can hear the water in the distance, but I can't. But um, these are the good trails what you can come doing, like on mountain bikes or walking. There's easier trails for like people that aren't able bodied, you know. But and then there's the hard parts for the, the younger and the fitter and people on on the bikes and stuff like that as well. Bit of a challenge, but they have got proper footpaths in as well. <sighs> we'll just take this path. Ah, we're going to this one, alright. <laughs> it's kind of slippy, I know he went at the same time. It's all this rain we've had over the last couple of days. It looks dry, dude, but it's still a bit dangerous. <laughs> Just leaving the camera on for a couple of minutes and we'll get down to the, down to the water here because it's... Instead of turning it off and on all the time, we'll just... I'm thinking it might make it a bit more interesting. No, oh, I. This is the uh, this is the part where I was looking for earlier. Maybe it'd be a good place to watch it. Maybe there. Aye. Aye, the wood. you would find the wax tails under here. Wax tails are rent and that. Aye. Uh, but anyways, we'll walk in. Walk in the water. I'd probably be better looking at it from doing the bottom, like wouldn't it? <sighs> We're going to do run. There's a little bridge there, no? I, I can never remember that, mind. You just forget though when you haven't been there. Aye. Yeah, seen it not. Seen that, all this was overgrown and all though, wasn't it? A lot of it would have been hidden. Really. But since they've opened all the paths back up, it's getting well used. Because you, when I was a kid, you were practically climbing doing the little paths doing here. But you can see they've all been washed up properly over the years. It's just completely changed doing here. There, there's a bit of an out. Bit of an old foundation of yeah, some, oh, and that's that some. Been buried, that was. It has yeah. to have been buried because I've never <laughs> seen that in my life. Never. It must have been all buried out by the sand. Aye, ah, yeah, and it's it's all it's all getting washed out eventually because I've never come across that before. Oh, it's them big rods, there, it's big steel, like board rod things sticking out of it. I don't know what they would have been for. There's a few there all the way along. I don't know what the purpose I don't know what the purpose of this has been. Somebody might know, somebody might comment on it. That's the river there and that we're looking down. It's quite a right wide little river, shall I? It'd be good for wide I'll tell them it is uh the bottom. Yeah aye, it is. And it's Probably is a nice place to either come camping, fishing. You will get a lot of it doing here, I suppose, wouldn't you? We're still at that little waterfall here. Um, we're just we're just walking up there. We've seen a grey wagtail flying out of the area. So it stands a good chance of there being one in here somewhere. But this is a nice little spot, isn't it? The watchers are picking the wind at the top there, but no, it's just getting hard to see. Aye. Is it just a disaster? Oh, it's like this. It's got a mess there, huh? Let me see if I can get up there without slipping out of the wind and getting a towel wet and slippy. It looks like it's a grey watcher, doesn't it? It does, huh? It's roughly similar to the other one that we've seen last time. Same sort of place under a under a ledge in the corner of a rock. Uh, I'll have a look on the camera to see what I'm saying to it. Well, it's got loads of little young ones in, huh? Oh, yeah. Little chicks, huh? Hmm? The one out the last one is just had the chicks to all way they were younger than that one. Ah, they were younger than that. The next time what they had been wrecked, you know? Something had gotten them and killed them, well, eaten them, the nest was on the floor. These ones look a bit of a safer place for them. To be brought up like um can you tell us how to the thing is the nest like that um I'll come back to them. Oh right, I that's a it's a dip off nest, isn't it? 
It's like a giant wren's neck. Oh, right, oh, you can see them. Oh, you can see the whole left hand up and under. I'll see one. I'm standing, it's out of cloth and water and slippy rock sides. I'm going to see if I can play more. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can get just under it to have a... It's got a good footing. It's the bird jump. It's the bird just jumped. Oof, nearly crossed myself. Right. I was a bit like this flew out there. It's practically under a waterfall, yeah. I'll zoom in for a bit, just for years. But that's a bit of neck. Yeah, I what? A bit of neck is what? The bit of neck is what? Just 10 foot of line. There's an old one. I was going to say it was 10 foot of line. Right, you might need to do that. Just uh, yeah. 10 foot. But there's the, the bit of there. And there's the two wheel wax tube. I mean, I can't really just push one up for it, but it's just in there anyway. No, it's in the same little spot. Oh, oh. After the 16th September, we're going to be here. No, I was pretty different. No, I... Hey, uh, getting there. Uh... We'll come up and we'll see some funny stuff today. As usual, right, we're, we're getting better. Mm -hmm. oh, I remember this as a kid, I always used to come down and climb down. But I think you would find the wrens and that stuff in there. You never find two in one, do Right, well, I'll turn the camera off and we'll get over here. We're just back onto the river here where, where that little platform was and the grey wagtails and the dippers. And this is what we're going to be trying to get up the side of the water here. It looks a bit rough, so we're going to try just to see if we can. We did used to do it when we were kids, but. I think it looks a lot worse now though. It's it does, half the bank side's been washed away, there was bits of platforms and that. No, there's just not much at all. I can see a few ducks up on the top corner. It's not really worth zooming in that far. Like. I'll just zoom in a little bit and might get them on camera. But you can see, you, from here you can not actually see the rock faces where we were standing on top of earlier. They threw the trees up there, I'm trying to see if I can... Ah, oh, you can see them there. But it's all like the rock crag sort of thing, crags they call them. There's a gun. And that's what we were standing on top of just before. When I was saying I was cracking myself, I had a good route really. It's probably, what is it, a good 50, 60 foot? Oh, I always say it's so like maybe, maybe it's even higher, it's one hell of a drop. When you're up there, it's, <laughs> it looks even worse. What we're going to do one day is come along the path, there's a pathway all the way along the other side. And we'll get some film of that. It's just that it would take too long the day by the time we got all the way back doing a run. We'll do that one on another day. But anyways, we're going to try walking up the side here yeah, and see what it looks like. Uh, we'll just, we'll just make our way back here. It's, we've got as far as that rock just in front there. It's, it's all covered in leaves and everything and you're standing, we're slipping down when nearly went in the water twice. It's quite bad all the way along, didn't think we were going to see much, so we'll just turn back. We're gonna we'll walk doing the, the little pathway a bit. We might see something a bit more interesting doing on the sides here. As you can hear the grey wag turning that up here. Yeah, we'll see. I'll turn the camera off. We're on top of the waterfall here. And that's our oak tree there. If you look down under it, you can see a dark patch. I think the wagtail's sitting on it, I'm starting to see its tail, is it? Sitting on the nest. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Ah, it's that dark patch in the middle of the camera that I'll, I'll zoom in slowly. You can see close up to here, but I'm starting to see its tail sticking out. It is, aye. Uh... So when it, when, it, when it been young, I thought it would have been feeding them and stuff all the time. They've got that, um, I don't know if you noticed when, like, young small birds have got like a yellow yolk sack in them still. All oh, right, I see. I think that keeps them going for like two or three days. So mostly at that age they'll just be sitting on keeping them sort of... Keeping them warm, uh, protecting them until they get strong enough, because they look like they're just hatched, didn't they? I mean, they're only one or two days yeah. old at the most. But if, if they are three days old, they might be feeding them every now and then, because that's, that's probably why so, it wasn't sitting on them when we came up, like. Maybe in the next couple of days it'll be constantly in the feed. Oh, there will be, aye. 
I'm just hoping that's a good clear shot. I can't really see on the lens of the camera. Well, on, um, it should be, I mean... I don't know if I'm too far away or if it's focusing in on these, now this tree is right in front of us. Now when you try to, try to film through I something. Aye, uh, yeah, I did from Stand that. Stand behind this little hole for me. Just get it on your hook. I said you should be, get a good one. Aye, uh, I can just see it. Anyways, that's it. The grey wag still sitting on a nest there. The second one will come across this year, isn't it? It's the second one, aren't you? And just across there is a dip that's from up here. Just, just from the, across from the little waterfall. You can't move the camera. Don't come here, you wouldn't even think of one nest, would you? Yeah, especially the dippers. No, oh, the dippers. Like a ball of, a ball of rubbish. Like mossy, grassy yeah. stuff, aren't yeah. right? The birds flew out of it one more, didn't they? I don't know if I caught oh, it on right. camera. Go for it. Was, uh, <laughs> just a black thing jumping out because we were looking at the grey wagtails at the time. Standing on that big rock and the, the dip had just flew straight in front of one. Uh, but it's sitting on them there now. Oh. Can you see? Mm. How was it there? We'll carry we'll, we'll on doing the path there a bit. I'll turn the camera off for now. Just across the, we're just a little bit further down from where we were. But just across this, the river there. When the camera focuses in, you'll see the, it's just a, a dip off sitting on the rock. It's not that normal, we've come to pass to get, hard to get a close shot of these, haven't we? Oh, so normally you'd normally just see them. I mean we got them um, ones. We got the some on the last video, didn't we? I can't quite close on that. We're quite a bit further down from where we were. So I mean you will find them every fifty to a hundred yards down the rivers, won't you? Because just doing there in the middle of the water does it. There's a few stones there and there's another grey wagtail, but they'll, they'll be nesting all the way down the rivers. It's the same in that zipper. It seemed a lot more common than what they did though, like Aye. 20 or 30 years ago, because you didn't see them as often as you did no. there now, did you? No, definitely not. They do seem a lot more common. I think we're just going to carry on doing the water a little bit. We might come across something a bit more different as well. We're just coming near to the end of the, the path. It went up when I first came in. You see, I'll be up there. But I'm not actually on the field side just to see if we can spot any rabbits and stuff like that in the field. Because we're, we're nearly back to the core, there's the main road along the end there. But I was walking along, I'd just seen this in here. Blackbirds, isn't it? It's either black a blackbird or a song thrush, I'm not really sure. I just see the tail like, but. Oh, I can see the birds sitting on it there. It's it's like you see the female blackbirds are brown anyway, so they've got a aye, similar colour from looks, the back, so it's aye. good. I, I can get a good shot from around here, mate. I can see it perfectly here. Is it a blackbird? It looks like one, aye. I'm hoping that's Actually, it. when we were, every hedge used to find the blackbirds, but they've become a lot more rare lately, haven't they? Aye. I'm hoping I'm zooming in on the good place, yeah. I mean, literally, every aye, garden, aye. every hedge, you could find the blackbirds in one sort of place. Rather, rather hot thing. Ah, that's what they used to. That's a nice, nice one to see. I didn't, I didn't really want to scare it off. I'll turn the camera off. That's the big trees we were looking at earlier when all the jackdaws and them go flying around over the place when we first came in. Oh, anyway. it's just flew off. All oh, right. Uh, I, I, just, I was just turning the camera off, just about a gun, and the bird actually jumped off the nest. So I might just have a quick look at it. Not sure if it's got them. Um, it's got four eggs in there. Mm. 
normally be a five, didn't it? Aye. Are them just single air? Or will they double? I think they're anywhere up the treble brood, aren't they? Blackbirds. Yeah. Uh, we get a good shot of that one, it been a bigger size nest. So that's our route, that. Well, come back and see if we can get a look at the Casio. Ah, it's an easy one to get in. They would be able to watch this one feeding them. So that's not too bad. Hopefully, nothing gets ah, to I know more, more something it. might not get to it. Yeah, ah, we might get to it. Well, we're, we're on our way again eventually. Oh, yeah. I'll turn the camera off now. We're, we're back to the main road. I'll turn it on again if we find anything decent, but otherwise, this is going to be the end of the day video. I can hear a wagtail over there again. That's what I was, I was actually walking down here in the hopes of finding a, a pied wagtail in here somewhere. That's what I was looking in there for and then come across the blackbirds, but I'd rather have been a pied wagtail because that's what we're, we're main object is at the moment. Remember across the road, I mean, the, the new houses now, but there used to be old barns and my new houses, the medament houses. Yeah, I can I remember the pied wagtails, what we used to... It always nested in there, didn't it? Yeah, Every year. I'll turn this off just to save power and save the memory cord until we come across anything else.